birthday party. Yeah. Yes, there's Uncle Aaron. Yes. Oh my goodness, look at all these gifts, Robbie. And we've got video games. Bubble machine. Music. Ambient music. There's Brittany. Hi. She's single. Local men. Local men. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I got it. Oh my goodness. Hey, I read in the Daily Bugle. Someone has a birthday party. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, Ruby. Look who's here. Ruby. Oh my gosh, Robbie, who is this? Robbie, who is that? Robbie, who is that? How you doing? Who's that, Robbie? Oh my gosh. You got to touch that. Robbie, who is that? Go say hi to him. What's your name? Anthony? Oh my gosh. What's your name? I'm kidding. I already know it's Robbie. You're, you're Spider Man? Yes. We're all Spider Man in our own way, right? Yeah. Oh my god. How old are you turning? Okay, how old are you turning? How old are you, Robbie? How many are you? I'm gonna be how old, Robbie? I'm just four. You're gonna be four? Yeah. That's crazy. I almost had four movies. And then the studio fell out, but that's a story for a different time. What's your name? Yeah, so <laughs> I get it. It's okay. Boundaries. Hey, Spider Man, do you want to want some web action with some cups? Sure. Oh, boy. He's going to be Oh, am I going to, am I webbing you or am I webbing you? Pretend. Robbie, do you want to try? I think we got to shake them up. <laughs> Show them how to do it. It's a diversion tactic. They're like, what is that? Bella, you want one? Yeah, show them how to do it. There's one for you. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna be like Spider Man. <laughs> oh, it's okay, Robbie. Robbie, it's okay. Here, Robbie, mommy, show you how to do it. He doesn't like me. Oh, I just oh like no, he just doesn't like human things. Ready? Ready? Just like Spider- well, just like me. Now, Robbie, you do it. Yeah. No? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I set him back up, but Aunt May just no, watched I'll my do it. Can someone else do it? I'm the, the Spider-Man guy. Are we shooting it again? Knock it down, let's see it. Knock it down! Woo! That's a sturdy one. Do you need some more? Let's let Bella do it. Bella, go! Oh my god! Spider Bella! Okay, that's what I thought. Unroll it. Oh boy. Alright, kids, I think Spider Man has to go. I do. He's got to go save someone. Can we take a picture with the kids? Oh, yes. Yeah. So you guys want to stand by the wall? You guys want a picture with Spider Man? Okay, let's get a picture. <laughs> Hi, pretty girl. Stella's checking out the window. So, currently, what I am doing, folks, is uh, this beautiful window here had plants all over the um, ledge. And Stella doesn't like that. She knocks everything over. So I have some acrylic shelves I'm gonna put on the windowsill. And so I am prepping cleaning the floor, prepping the window. So I'm gonna give you a shot later. So here's all my tools and gadgets to clean the window. 
and uh, you know, house is dirty, whatever. Life is life, right? So I'm going to give you another shot with acrylic shelves on there that I bought on Amazon. So, and um, all the water spots that you see are from outside. Because uh, I don't know how to clean windows outside. So, if any tips, let me know in the comments below. Thanks, bye. Okay, now I have taken off the stickies and have pressed it on there for like 30 seconds and put some, ooh, putting some weight on it. Um, this one came broken and Daniel super glued it, but I honestly don't think I can put a lot of weight on it. Um, so I have another shelf. I'm not sure if I want it because we open this window quite a bit to let fresh air in. So I'm thinking I might put it somewhere else. Uh, maybe a different window, like our front window or another window. So who's to say you can only use these in certain windows? And so that's my thought process. Hi, Stella. And see, plenty of room for the kitty. She's so beautiful. Stella. Hi, girl. She's such a good cat and such a sweet, sweet, loving cat. I haven't had a cat in like three years because mine passed away. So I don't mind making changes to fit my family. And Stella is definitely one of the family members. So I'm gonna style this now and I'll catch you back later. Bye. So now I've styled. So I've got my baby succulent here and um, some string of bananas. I bought these little nursery pots on Amazon. Um, got a Thanksgiving cactus, some Benjamina ficus, and then um, this is another uh, bonsai. It's uh, for my bonsai. I'm just taking clippings, putting them in amber bottles. I tried a bigger bottle up here. It's too heavy. So keep in mind the little four inch pots or smaller is probably best. And then this area, she doesn't bother as much. And this is chives and uh, another pothos um, and Brazilian that I'm trying to revive, but it's not doing well. Um, it didn't sprout roots for me. So I'm trying to, and they love lots of sun. So, um, but essentially there's my other window. This is all my other plants. And I love using this area for all my plants. They like the humidity. Um, but unfortunately, I run out of space. You know, go figure. Plant lady runs out of space. <laughs> so here is all the leftover plants. Like I tried this amber glass too heavy. Just way too heavy. So this is more for little plants, but look at how nice that looks. And it's off the counter. Stella can go to the window. I can open this window to let a breeze in, which is what I'm doing right now. So I really like these. Just, you know, make sure you wash your windows and stick them on there. And I just think this looks fabulous. Yay, I love doing things that function for my family and for me, it brings me some happiness um, to grow things and to nurture something in my life that isn't, uh, you know, taking care of residents all day, which is my normal job. So, and I, I love the little pots are so cute. Um, so, and Stella likes to knock this over all the time and I cry every time she does. So, um, hopefully Stella has all this space to roam and she can, uh, have her space and respect mine. So I hope you enjoyed that little tour of my plants. I'm trying to uh, let you guys in on my life a little bit more, um, but I don't think any of you want to see uh, me clean up my house in this mess right behind me. Maybe you do. If you would like to see something like that, let me know. Or um, I've got fish care. I can talk about fish care. There's my cat rolling around, you know. Um, if you'd like to see more of that, let me know. Comment 
comment, subscribe, but I thought you would really, really enjoy these plants. Um, I know some of my friends have lots of plants and uh, they're so enjoyable. Bring so much joy and happiness to my life. Robbie, say hi. Can you say hi? Hi, mommy. And there's my gorgeous son. So I'm gonna give you a tour of the now new tank. Here is some platies. Red panda platy, a tiger platy, and then these are all platies. They're all just different colors. Black. But they are so cool, and I got some, it's a red looking platy. So, so far, I have, those two black ones are males. And then I have two females are the yellow. That's a male. Anyways, everybody seems to adjust, and uh, my big fish are hiding in the back. I don't know what they're doing, but you can kind of... I got a Cory angelfish. Koi angelfish. And trying to get them to come out. I heard they're aggressive, so I'm trying to kind of watch everybody. So far, no aggression is happening because, well, it's... They're kind of just checking each other out right now. But these platies are great. They are just slim and happy and a lot of them hide under here. Of course they love the cave. It's out of the sunlight. There you are. Hey. Come on out. And then our angel fisher are hiding back there. Don't know why. Trying to look for the other one. They're big fish. Big, 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 big fish. There it is, the peak of yellow. Come on. Quit being shy. So, that's my tank. I'll record when they come out. Okay, I found it. Way in the corner. There you are. Hi. They're so beautiful. And here's what's going on in the party backstage. <laughs> And the other one's just kind of right there. Come on, buddy. Come on. We can see you. Yeah, you can. Hi, you got all those bright colors. So, the new house, Casa de Marina. <laughs> so excited. More fish in this tank. Right, they finally came out. There's my koi angelfish. They are so beautiful with those orange and red. Oh, he's got a little bit of darker colors. So they're supposed to be six inches in lengthwise. So this one's a little smaller. They're so beautiful. Wow. Wow. I just love watching them. They are like angels. They just glide. My brother's like, no, I like these ones. He wants to swim and move fast. I don't know. I tend to love a fish that just kind of glides and... You know, you can see the fins moving, so I see movement. I see something totally different. They're so beautiful. tests I've done. pH, ammonia, uh, nitrate, 
and nitrite. So now we're gonna look at our chart. So our pH is probably 6.4 looks like. And then it's high range pH. Now we're gonna go to ammonia. Hallelujah, we're at probably zero, maybe 0 0.2. Um, this is my, so that's the last one. This is nitrate, and we are at zero ppm, so no toxins yet, or not as many. And then here is my nitrate level, which I did a water change, and it looks like we're at zero. So. What this tells me is the pH is a little low. Um, I do have a pH booster I can put in there that will bring up the pH, which I kind of want to do. So, but all of this tells me that the tank is doing absolutely great. And I test about once a week or test every two weeks, um, depending how I feel. Um, so that these guys are happy and healthy and it tells me if I need to do water change if uh, the ammonia level is higher or the nitrate levels are higher I need to do a water change to make sure these guys um, aren't swimming around in their poo essentially because that's what they are doing they eat and they poo in their tank and that's what makes them healthy and happy so uh, thank you for watching my, my, uh, fish update. Awesome. Fish, happy fish keeping is another hobby of mine. Say bye bye guys. Till next time. So, Marina's job today. Get these dishes taken care of while I look at gorgeous plants. I think I can do it.
Are you the princess? Are you the princess? Oh, yes, you are. Beautiful day. Sun is watching TV while mommy cleans. Beautiful day. So, I'm going to be cleaning my cardboard. Um, it is gross and disgusting. So, here's the good, the bad, and the ugly. I'm just going to do a little walk through. Yuck. Beautiful bike I need to bring out. Oof. Christmas stuff. Old crib. Like this is going to be a job and a half. Um, so. This is my carport that, uh, needs to be addressed. So I'm going to be working on this. So hope you uh, enjoy watching me work on this mess. Very good though. I got a few things drying like stroller rug. And that was all under my car for I'm giving away for free for the dump. I can pick up. I'm gonna call them if it's there on Monday. Yeah, pretty productive day. Here is my brother's turtle tank. Here, here is Sheldon. Say hello, Sheldon. Ooh. Beautiful turtle. Likes to eat all the frickin' time. And this is Roshi. Roshi, hello. Hi. So yeah, my brother has two turtles. And Roshi, her, yeah, Roshi's pretty big. You can see the glare of me in there. He's got some tiger barbs, minnows, and your rainbow sharks over there in the corner. I don't know where Elvira is, but he's got a... 
Oh, there she is. There she under is, the... way back there. On the wall. You can't see her from there. Where are you? Oh, that's just... You ain't gonna get it. Well, she's right there hiding in the corner. Oh, so is the <laughs> clown plaque, though, I think. Hi, Sheldon. Hi, you think I have food for you, huh? You think plaque. I have food? And these are cherry barbs, right? Yeah, the small ones. Cherry barbs. And my brother built this outdoor enclosure. And they like to come up here and bask. Not on the heat lamp. Or one of them likes to bask. There. And this is my brother's second fish tank. He's got some platies and tetras and there's a quarry hello he's got this little 10 gallon tank and he's got shrimp and we bought fish today so i'll check you guys later with my new tank update bye bye this is callie hello callie Say hi, pretty girl. She's like, I am living my best life. Hi, Callie. She's a stray. My family picked up. Uh, where's Abby? Where's Abby? There's Abby. Hi, Abby. Here we are at Pacific Sushi. Pacific Sushi. For day night. We're gonna try it out. We'll yeah. give you our thoughts. A friend owns this place, so <coughs> let's try this out. Much oh, better. Look at that. Look at how pretty it looks, you know? <laughs> I'm gonna watch you eat this. You ready? Ah, I did it without breaking this time. That never oh, happened. Wow. Your ginger, you got your soy ginger. sauce. You gotta pour your own. You gotta do the finger on the tip. Bloop. Like that. You know what we should have got was some some edamame. Oh. You know what I mean? Well, we can ask him, and then he goes very little ginger to mix it up. That's not ginger. What is that? Wasabi. This is ginger. Wasabi. This is wasabi. Oh, oh I so see. The ginger that. is the, ginger is right the palate cleanser. Why do you need a palate cleanser for what you're eating? So, the flavor profiles between different rolls uh -huh. are so different that we want the ginger to to, to break it up, cleanse <laughs> the the taste buds. Mm -hmm. That way, you're not mixing flavors on your tongue. Uh -huh. At least that's what they say. I don't really care because it all tastes delicious anyway. All right. Well, go ahead and take a bite. What do you think? Well, it's well. That question is as good as Mukuni's. No. But it's very good. It's not Winco. Brand You're right, it's not Winco. So here's mine. Very, very, very tasty. I like it. Here we are with Godzilla. The Godzilla, first bite. There you go, buddy. <laughs> Good. So here we are at Sonic Drive Thru getting a uh, He's going to get M&M, M&M and, &M and Reese's. Reese's, and I'm going to get uh, cookie dough, chocolate yeah. chip cookie dough, ice Good. cream. So, um, you know, we can make the magic happen. <coughs> and by magic, I mean falling asleep, right, early? Falling asleep. Falling asleep, yeah, you know, after our son goes to bed... You know, we're gonna whip out the ice cream. Mmm, yum yum. And we're gonna 
fall asleep real good. Yeah, after the ice cream, right? After the ice cream, yep. Oh my god! <laughs> and they have yet to take our order. We're just sitting yeah, here. Still waiting for her to say something, really. Hi, welcome to Sonic. Can I take your order? Right. I'm going to help this along. <laughs>